<laughs> You're giving me goosebumps under the armor. Yes, I'm sure meeting me is spine tingling. How about I tingle yours? Hey, DC fans, this is Digital Charcuterie. I'm James. Thank you so much for joining us right now. As we talk about Blue Beetle, please give us a like and a subscribe and shout out to all of our new subscribers over the past little while. It has been phenomenal to see. We talked a little bit earlier about Sandra Bullock possibly playing a villain in the Blue Beetle movie. Now there's more news. We have all this amazing casting stuff coming out of here. George Lopez playing the uncle. It just, this movie, I'm going to tell you right now, I'm super excited. But I want to talk about James Marsden. Rumor is right now that Warner Brothers and the filmmakers would like James Marsden to play Ted Cord in the upcoming Blue Beetle motion picture. Ted Cord, that is right, the second Blue Beetle. Here's the thing, you got to take this with a grain of salt, of course, but this makes complete sense to me. I absolutely love this because Ted Cord was more of a wisecracking Blue Beetle. He was a fun-loving Blue Beetle. And if you have Victoria Cord, this made up character who could be related or married to or whatever, Jarvis Cord, so that would mean Ted Cord could be the nephew of Sandra Bullock's or whoever's Victoria Cord would be perfect in this. And of course, you would have to kill off Ted Cord. And I think, you know, movies, especially comic movies, they succeed a lot more when you have a major death would allow Jamie Reyes, of course, to come in and become the next Blue Beetle and he would understand what's going on. Or you can even have a passing of the torch type thing right there. But this sounds absolutely great. James Marsden seems like a perfect choice for this. He's not a young buck anymore like he was when he portrayed Cyclops 20 years ago. He's of that age now when the passing of the torch would make sense. And he's still wisecracking. He crushes it in the Sonic movie. Sonic 1, Sonic. He absolutely crushes it and even those. And everybody likes James Marsden. He just shows up and everybody likes him and it makes perfect sense put him in this and if you don't kill him off he can, su can succeed in the way that michael douglas succeeds in the ant-man franchise sure he's not as old as michael douglas but still you have that you can even have two blue beetles going around obviously look booster gold is showing up we know that that cast is gonna happen but james marsden right now is who the rumor is this is who they want to portray Ted Core. And like I said earlier today on the Sandra Bullock video, I think that the whole Cord storyline is gonna play, play a huge part in DC films going forward above and beyond Blue Beetle. I am hoping that Lady Sticks does show up in Blue Beetle, but is not the big bad of Blue Beetle. I am hoping that Justice League, whatever they have, this huge massive plan with Justice League, and again, this is where Ted Cord could factor in that Lady Sticks could be the big bad for a Justice League film down the road, Justice League 2 or a rebirth, Justice League, whatever you want to call it, Lady Sticks could be your big bad in that one, like Dark Side should have been in a Snyder sequel to Justice League. That's my hope right now. I like this idea. I hope that this is tangible. I hope this is factual. I hope somebody is. I hope someone has slid a check over to James Marsden and said, hey, come over and join DC. He was in Superman Returns, and of course he was in X-Men, and now he's in Sonic, crushing it. As always, what do you guys think? Can you see James Marsden portraying Cord in the DC Universe? Or are you like, this is just a hoax, this is a rumor? Shut the door, stop it with the rumors! I don't know what it is, but I'm hoping this is factual because I like he's such a great actor. He's a great addition to everything. I say do it. Blue Beetle, August 2023, cannot come here soon enough. That's two months after the flash, by the way. Two months after the flash take that with you all right everybody i'm gonna leave it at that for now thank you so much for watching and taking some time to spend some time with us here at digital charcuterie please give us a like and subscribe and until next time may you be the master of your own universe